Shot 83, take one. Next up to the table we have DJ Misbehaving, one of the few girls on the Tidy Tracks roster. Her real name is Nikki. I'm going to talk to you now, Nikki. Amadeus, lead the way with your questions. Can I look at question one? Because all these questions have actually been sent in by a six-year-old. Oh. Uh, <laughs> question one. It's quite a simple one for a six-year-old. Where are you from and how long have you been DJing? It's a double question. Two is in one. Allowed? It's allowed. <laughs> Two in one. Two is um, better than one. I'm from... I think people can probably guess with the accent, can't they? Yes, I'm from down south. You're not from Yorkshire, love. You're not from Yorkshire. I'm not, I'm not from up north. So what part down of down south. south are you from? Um, just near Gatwick Airport. Very good. I live on a house. In a house? Which is yeah. nice. With sheep by the side. <laughs> sheep by the side. Are they there yes. permanently or do they run around? Um, it depends if it's Sunday or not. Good. All right. And how long have you been DJing? About four years. Four years. Same as Lee Haslam. Yeah? Five, five, five Lee's been DJing five, five years. It has yeah, to go one better. But you can't count Lee. Yeah, Lee's Eighteen, there. 18 Big years, deal. DJ. You weren't even born, you just spoke. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, uh, you can ask this one. Uh, do you do, please, order. Do you do a lot of misbehaving when you're out? Hence your name, DJ Misbehaving. Are you a good girl or a bad girl? Good girl, bad girl. Um, I can't really answer that because I think my grand's watching. And your father. And your yes. father is actually involved in the business, I believe. Yes, yes. But let's just presume he's not looking. <laughs> and, uh, what about my grand? She's 97. She won't be able to hear She's it. definitely not going to be there. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yes, the name does suggest that you're a little bit naughty. Yeah, but misbehaving doesn't mean sexual. Like you're always I jumping. wasn't taking it down that road. A bit naughty playing tricks on people. Spitting you. in a park. Spitting in a park. You're going down the sex route. So, back to the... Uh, <laughs> back to the question, sorry. So, do you want to ask that or not? Um, are you a good girl? It's a six-year-old question. I am a good girl. You are a good girl. She's a very nice girl, actually. I like her a lot. So, there's no misbehaving to be had, apart from when you're in the box, maybe. Bit of misbehaving, bit of larking around. Behind the decks, yeah. Behind yeah, the decks, yes, yes. Good. Yes, yes. Question three. Do you like it hard? Oh, yeah. Trancy or funky? <laughs> Tra Trancy or funky? Oh, right. Um, <laughs> I thought we were asking another question. No, it's, it's, um, it's a three barrel question. I think. Do you like it hard? There's a big gap there. Trancy or funky? That's comedy timing, isn't it? It's comedy timing. Yep. I like it a bit trancy, but like it hard as well. You like it hard as well? A bit funny. You do as well, don't you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you like it hard and a bit trancy. Yeah. A bit like Lee Aslam, really. <laughs> Uh, right, question four <laughs> from Andy. <laughs> what headphones do you use and why do you use them? A lot of DJs use different ones, the Sony, the Technics. What is your chosen weapon, Nikki? Um, I use a Sennheiser. Sennheiser. Because the insides are really soft on your ears. They are, but and are they, they not? Keep, they are, keep your head together. But are they not <laughs> prone to breakage? They do break though, don't they, a lot? I've known these slashes go through two pairs in one night. Have you had trouble with these Sennheisers? The wire comes out. Um, yeah, because I'm just chew it. But it just wobbles out, it's just not, I don't think... I think it's an important, important question for the kids there. A bit of a recommendation on headphones. Do you find your sunizers are a durable But affair? I look after mine. Good. Right. That's good. If you're not misbehaving, you're going to look after them, aren't you? Of course. Question six... No, there's no question six. Uh, right, we've got the 30 seconds thing now, which is uh, very funny. You've got... Uh, you're not doing that question then. Question five. Ah, there is question five. Sorry, I couldn't read the small print. Uh, question five. If you had a disease where your hands grew too big for the size of your arms, would you remove them? Like, would you have them cut off? Clown. Like, if they were like, bat, like that, you had to walk around like that. <laughs> <laughs> would you have them cut off? That's really tricky. It is tricky, yeah. Because um, people would laugh. Because either way they'd laugh. They'd laugh at your either big hands or maybe your stumps. <laughs> well, maybe it might be quite good Good to, for DJing. Of, you know. Waving at people? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, I think I could get used to having big hands. Yeah, I think I'd like it. You're going to hold a lot of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> the oven gloves would fit better, wouldn't they? Yeah. They would. So, uh, all yeah, this, yeah, you, so you keep your hands. Yeah, I definitely right. keep, keep my your hands. hands. And I'm sure the fingers would get longer, and they're always a bonus. <laughs> uh, right, can you talk now for 30 seconds? Get the watch ready, Andy. Is it the same watch? Yep. Right. <clears throat> can you talk about rocks, pebbles, and stones for 30 seconds without. Sneezing, laughing, or cracking up. 30 seconds start now. now. 
Rocks are fascinating. Mm. Stones are also very fascinating, but they shouldn't be thrown, so take note, kids. Mm. But pebbles are great, and I used to live in Brighton, and the beach is full of stones and pebbles. Nice. But don't stick them up your nose. <laughs> I was only three at the time, but I stuck a pebble up my nose, and is that fit to No, tell us about that, we're interested now. And yeah, no story. Stop that. I got it stuck. Oh, well, the 30 seconds is up, right, let's continue yeah, the discussion what, about Which the nostril and... Uh, is it still up there? And what happened? It's still there. It's still there? <laughs> no, not really. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> I fell for that one, didn't I? Was it a sharp one? Did it bleed? No, pebbles are... Did it come out easy? Did they force it out of the hospital? I can't remember, I was too young. Snot everywhere. Uh, lots of stuff. <laughs> so we're released from this torture. Okay, sorry about that, but uh, put your hands together. Misbehave. Oh, well, well, well. Thank you very much, Nikki. And back to this.